Hey artists, today we are making a beauty walk collage inspired by the book Last Stop on Market Street and by the illustrator of that book, Christian Robinson. This project starts with gathering inspiration on what I like to call a beauty walk. You'll need to take several pieces of paper and some crowns with you on your walk. You can take a walk around your school, your house, your neighborhood, or city. Artists are excellent observers. And by this I mean that artists notice the details in small but important things. Look closely and carefully. You might even have to get down close to the ground to notice something new. Sketch out your ideas on paper. Also look closely for the amazing textures of the world around us. Actual texture is the way something feels when you reach out and touch it, while implied texture is when something is created to look as though it would feel a certain way. You can take something called a rubbing to capture these textures for your artwork later. Remove the paper wrapping from your crown, turn it on its side, and rub it against your paper when it is sitting on top of an interesting texture. Artists are able to make the ordinary extraordinary, and this is what the book means by witnessing beauty. What kinds of things are in your neighborhood that people walk past every day without giving much thought to? When we pay attention, we notice just how incredible small things are. Using the inspiration from our beauty walk, let's make a collage by gluing down bits of paper. Look at Christian Robinson's illustrations. Notice that they are very simple shapes. Just circles, triangles, rectangles, and squares put together to make a human form. Play around with the paper pieces to build what you need. I see a woman walking her dogs every day in my neighborhood and it makes me smile. So I decided to include her in my artwork. In addition to cutting out shapes, you can also draw onto your construction paper. Just don't forget to add collage pieces too. Even though I drew this dog with a pencil, I'm going to be adding a collar and spots from my different papers. Here you see me arranging and gluing down my pieces onto a piece of background paper so that they don't get lost. When I'm done gluing, I'll cut around the shape to use it for later. Next, I'm collaging all the other elements of my beauty walk. 
You're gonna see a window covered in green ivy, a blue jay's feather, an apartment mailbox with lots of numbers, and some shiny balloons floating in the wind. Now that my beauty walk pieces are made, I'm gonna make a background for them to live on. Using a long piece of background paper, I'm gonna assemble buildings from the textured papers that I made on my walk. Don't forget to add extra details like windows and doors. Once my background is finished, I decide where to place my collage pieces and then glue them down. Don't forget to sign and title your work on the back. And now you have an incredible artwork inspired by the beautiful world around you. Mm -hmm.